Hello, Ren here, bringing part 116 of the Byzantine Empire campaign. We are going to go to Cleon and sell jokes, little people. And also, we still have Medium Crown Authority, which is incredibly unfortunate. And no one's going to vote in our favour because no one likes us. And we cannot be able to flip votes. Last we will try, even if we have to get to a holy war against us. Anyways, though, it's not the end of the world, especially since our military is so great. We have such a high total that basically no one in the world can really stop us. And that's totally fine, not even the Mongol Empire. So the fact that they have 15,000 men, that's so sad. I didn't expect them to do anything soon. That's what they get for trying to fight good Byzantines. Anyhow. Let's go and declare the war. So what war are we going to declare? Well, a small duchy called Anatolia. Part of our digital empire I would like back. And we're going to clean a bit of our borders with um, the Seljuks. Let's go, and play the wall. We'll pretty much raise everyone that we can. We'll pretty much disband anyone who's going to die. There we go. Unfortunately, we're not well liked in the Empire. So we'll have to use different measures to basically get people to like us a bit more. So let's see here. Luckily, the King of France will supply a large army, though no really good amount of boats can help us. So let's gather up all the troops. Gather up everyone, we'll pretty much send them to our coast. And since this wall isn't too big, you know, it's for a large landmass, we will basically landing all of our troops in the shoreline that we have. There we go. You need to have boats. That's fine. Let's get everyone down here. Just march. There we go. And once we have everyone down in their positions, we will simply see down as quickly as we can and win the war. Of course, Knight Simple I really want to fight us all the time. So they're going to arrive on 30th of June, of some time. I don't know how many troops are going to arrive by then. I 
think we'll maybe have enough. That's gonna be close. Of course, it's a Knights Templar of all people who really want to see us gone. A Knights Hospital, anyway. If our boat's gonna tell them. Nope. They will be sending a large amount of uh, troops their way. Hopefully, we can win it. There we go. An excellent win for us. Simply get all our troops ready. Start sieging us down. Measure any unlocked troops. Hopefully, this will be enough for us. 4,000 troops. That is not something you can shy away from. Hopefully, we've got enough forces here to put the pressure on. I think 20. And we're losing better troops. This actually be a bit more costly war than I expected it to be. But it's fine. The I should um, capitulate early. Since uh, it's only two provinces. Not taking that much from them. There we go. Also, a daughter, Petronia. I mean, uh, I did say I wanted a son. Like a son, please. Is this all of our troops we're gonna have? Looks like it. Perhaps it'd be a bit idea to maybe not solve this one. You'll see. No. Oh wait, we will wait it down. They would like small troops here. Looks like everyone's really trying to get here. Hey, we actually have ten, actually 10,000 men. We still need more boats. Okay. Let's try and get those men there. Hey, you know what? Let's go and just send our full force here. Because, like, this wall ramped up a bit quickly. And we are losing a bunch of men to attrition. 7%. I think the sooner the better. We'll get this done. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's painful. Yeah, let's get the sieges over with. It's just since the entire world's really trying against us. Who are you? Hmm, interesting flag. No matter. I 
Okay, just assault that. Really need this land quickly and as painful as possible, it seems nowadays. Seventy-three percent. We should be able to. There we go. You'll surrender. Lost a bit of troops. Bit nice to be expected. And now, we find the king of Antolia. We create the duchy. Or not? Can you usurp it? Yes, I can. That'd just be a lot better if I took it to you. Let's see. There we go. It's all better now. Now we have a uh, King Vendulia who absolutely loves us because we gave him much in land. And also slightly gets rid of the Seljuks in this area. Ah. Look at that. Looks so good. We're so close to getting that done. One more duchy in all of Turkey. Maybe part of our empire. Nearly all of Turkey. We have very small factions, luckily. Well, it's small and they're actually growing a bit faster than I wanted to do. Unfortunately, do. It seems that no one wants to vote for our law. How crazy is that? I'll have to go fix that sometime. As the farmers prepare sowing the spring crops, your court chaplain suggests they bring the holy relic in position and bless the field, surely there's the likelihood of a plentiful harvest this year. Why not? Also hold the summer fair too. Also, we still have the revolt going on in France. Luckily it's in uh, France's favour. Hopefully go away soon enough. And I inherited uh, a barony. This land over here. I think? No. Let's check over here. Some random barony. Oh, over here. There we go. Let's create a new vassal. Ah, uh, everything's so peaceful. As long as you don't make everyone upset. A bit upset. And some affairs not going as well as planned. And that's it. That was all some affair. End as quickly as it started. Also, uh, wife, can you be pregnant once more? I know we're relatively young, but I need a son. 
I mean, a good sun is not going to completely ruin us. See, you improve the relationships of uh, Serbia. How much do you like me? 31. Not that good. I don't be um, a bit faster now. Let's see. Hey, Bishop can marry. Let's hold a feast and uh, see who can marry. Oh, sure, why not? Marry into Serbia's line, what can go absolutely wrong? Oh. Well, at least I can get the law passed now, hopefully. Jahan for Mesopotamia. The great Sheikh Caleb. Panem has found a called jihad against the Kafirs and the Sultanate in Mesopotamia. He had his own right to Shia Muslim take up arms against the brave Bastilia Seb Sebastianus and the Byzantine Empire, but the glory of Islam allowed the merciful. Oh, what a surprise! We have the Fatimids declaring again. Um, sure, something. Play our feast or something. Okay, well, basically me versus him, and as every other war goes, we'll probably do just fine. Where's this even for again? Mesopotamia? Is this this land over here? Oh, kingdom? I don't even know what you want. Oh well. At the very least, they will stop getting all of our boats again. And hopefully, people will decide to. Oh, I don't know. Not revolt as per usual. Also, this revolt gives us 10,000 men, though we cannot do anything with them. So I'll just sit here at the coast, see if I'm able to pick you up. of all the French troops with not enough boats, as per usual. So let's see if Croatia can make up the slack. There we go. And of course we will get everyone on the boat, as per usual. I mean, was this totally a surprise? No, not really. The fact that they do this every other Friday, I always do be expected they do it once more. Let's go get up all the boats. Get up all the troops. I'll oh, say put them here. Why not? But with that, I think I need to come up on here. 
So in the next episode, we'll take care of the Fat Mids. Hopefully we'll take care of this lol too. But, I'll see you then, and goodbye.